Jerome, you've just signed on, on loan from Fulham. Welcome to Argyle. How are you feeling? I'm feeling good, thanks. Yeah, it's a big club. Just happy to get ready to get started. Tell us a, a little bit about how the move came about, because as I understand, you, you've been here training with the lads for a few days now. Yeah, I've been here. I came in on Tuesday, and I've just been training with the lads, just getting a feel of the place, and we're just really waiting for the paper came to get sorted, but now that's all done. Was it always kind of, it, it wasn't a trial as such when you came here, you'd no. already agreed yeah. the loan, but yeah. it was just kind of to get a few days experience with, yeah, with the lads. How, how have you found that? Yeah, no, it's been good. Uh, the facilities are great here. Mm, the lads are great and the managers, everyone's really taken me in, so it's been good so far. What did you um, What did you know about Argyle before, before you agreed to come here? Uh, I know you had a good season. Last season, Leeds, you got promoted. Uh, it's a big club, we see loads of history, so yeah, that's really it. And the style of play uh, is a uh, play out the back, you know, really just a long ball team, so yeah, so that's really it. Um, you, you've got experience at this level, which is obviously really, really important. You were, you were at Accrington on loan last year. Yeah. I understand that you um, played primarily at, at, there at left back yeah. but you can also play at centre back what for those who, who maybe are not familiar with with you as a player mm -hmm. and, and what you bring what would you say your strengths are i say I'm a ball playing centre back so I think that's why I can always fill in at left back uh, strong and I'm quite quick so yeah that's my strengths really and I like to get on the ball and step out of it dribble and yeah take a good chances with it like yeah you um you've been at Fulham since I think you were nine years old yeah. that right a long time and uh, towards the end of not last season the season before I think yeah. you were made captain of the under 23 team would you say that kind of you bring a bit of leadership qualities as well would you say you're a natural leader yeah 100% I think uh, in certain circumstances and I could take that role and then like lead the team and yeah like push people on and give people confidence so yeah my leader. Yeah. You've uh, you've joined us, I think, until January initially. Mm -hmm. You know, maybe until the end of the season things mm -hmm. go well. Um, what are your kind of personal? Uh, what are you hoping to achieve while you're here at Argo? Obviously, uh, just get the games in, win. I like my winner, so winning is important to me. Uh, and learning new things from the manager and the team. So yeah, just getting the games and just moving up the league with the team. Yeah. And in, in terms of that team, you've had a few days with them now. I don't know if you were following sort of the games we've played so far this mm -hmm. season, but uh, how do you feel you fit in with the group? Uh, yeah, you done win against Blackpool. I see the draw against uh, AFC, and you know there's some quality players, a good team. So now it's just about my addition, what I can bring to the team. As I've said, I'm fast, I'm strong, uh, I'm good on the ball, so. Yeah, there's just a lot of things to to add to the team, which I believe I can. You um, to start with, you you won't get the experience of, of playing in front of our supporters, but yeah. you, you may be aware we've got quite a large, passionate fan base. I wonder yeah. if you have a, a message to them now that you signed for us. Yeah, no, I'm just grateful to be here and uh, thank you really, and I hope I can do the best I can. Yeah, thank you. Wish you luck. Oh, cheers.